Christmas guys. Good morning and welcome back to Twisted Stitches. My name is Tammy. How is everybody doing? So today is Saturday, December 25th, 2021. Uh, yeah, I'm wearing my Christmas. <laughs> my favorite color is Christmas lights. I am going to be wearing this all day today. So <laughs> it is Christmas. I can't believe it's Christmas already, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, I look like craziness this morning. Sorry. So we are here for the final day of Felicity Yarn Studios 2021 Christmas Advent inspired by the artwork of Miss Georgia O'Keefe. This is the last time I'm saying this, guys. So today's art inspirational piece is called Abstraction Blue. And I do have a couple of pictures, just so you know, because I did find a couple of pictures this time. So here is one of the the pictures or screenshots that I took of this uh, particular painting. Here is another one. I'm, I'm just, there's a little bit of differences, not a lot, but I just figured I'd put it out there like I've been. This one here is one I got off of GeorgiaO'Keefe.net. It's kind of going to be just whatever one Zoe had seen, whatever one she got and based it off of. So that's all I have um, on that. So Abstraction Blue was done in 1927 and it is an oil on canvas. So I was researching, like I always do, about the painting. And there was a little blurb about Miss O'Keefe, a little tidbit, if you will, and I'd love to share it with you on this final day. We'll just take a little bit longer. I won't take too much of your time. I know everybody's busy. O'Keefe decided as a child that she was going to be an artist when she grew up. Although she was unsure of what kind of art she would make, she later recalled, I hadn't a desire to make anything like the pictures I had seen. Indeed, O'Keefe's long career was marked by ceaseless invention for which she received near constant acclaim, starting with her earliest paintings, which debuted in 1916 at New York's famous 291 Gallery and continuing to her death seven decades later. In 1946, O'Keefe was the subject of the Museum of Modern Arts first retrospective exhibition devoted to a woman artist. Although O'Keefe is best known for figurative paintings of flowers, skulls, and the desert landscape of New Mexico, where she settled in 1946, the artist focused on abstract representation during the first phase of her career, from the 1910s into the 30s. Abstraction Blue, from this period, exemplifies the freedom O'Keefe felt and the possibilities she explored at this time through art's most basic building blocks. I found that I could say things with color and shapes that I couldn't say in any other way. Things I had no words for, she explained, which I think we have a lot of that in our work as a fiber artist. Some things we can't explain, we just, just there. It states that uh, Abstraction Blue is a painting dominated by undulating swirls and curves of the blue tones emanating from the lower half of the canvas, bisected by a lighter crevice of paint that cuts the canvas vertically. So I guess those are the undulating swirls and the white that bisects it vertically. <laughs> So I don't know. I'm not an art critic, so I don't know. I just know I look at something and go, I either like it or I don't. So here it is. Here's the big daddy, the big, the big Santa Papa Claus, if you will. The 25th. This is the full 100 gram skein. And you saw our inspirational art piece. So I am dying to see this. You guys, Are you guys ready? Let me see. Oh, it is really taped. <laughs> she taped this. I guess she didn't want nobody peeking. I did not peek, by the way. I was good. I was good. I mean, I'll admit to sometimes I'll take a little teensy tiny peek here and there, but I don't like to look fully at it. And this one, I didn't even get a little teensy tiny peek. Ooh, this is pretty, guys. 
this uh yeah i'm gonna have to keep this one away from tom because he likes blues and well it has some purple in it too so maybe look guys here we go here is the big one look at those colors oh, look at look at those little pretty purple shots in there and these real pretty light and darker blues and there's speckles oh this is pretty so let's have a look at the inspirational photo. Let's see. I'm going to use this one. I think she may have gotten it from this one because I can see the lighter tones of blue and a few of the deeper tones of blue and that little bit of light violet purple right there as you can see inside here. Can you see that? Let me give you that. I'm going to, I'm not going to open it, but I'm going to show you. See that right there? See all those? I think inside here, I'm going to have a lot of different tones and stuff. See some darker tones in there. This is going to be so pretty worked up. Oh yes. I think this is a great interpretation of this painting. Definitely. I really like it. So there you go, guys. That's it. This is day 25. So this is day 25 of Felicity Yarn Studios 2021 Christmas Advent featuring art inspired by Miss Georgia O'Keeffe. It is gorgeous. So let's put this on here. I kind of wish I could have taken every like half of it off and put it in the middle and put the rest off, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to put it at the end our heavy duty handy dandy wooden dowel for the last time this year here we go i'm gonna put this right here i know it looks kind of awkward but i'm gonna have to squeeze these in a little bit so here is the entire advent So there you have it, guys. That's it. So I hope you guys have a fantastic Christmas. I hope you have a wonderful New Year, just in case I don't see you until after the New Year's. You guys, thank you so much for always coming back and supporting my channel like you do. It's very much appreciated. I want you to know that. You guys are the best. I love you guys very much. I'll be talking to you guys very, very soon. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Take care. Merry Christmas. Bye.